Hello my wonderful friend, welcome to today's masterclass. Today we will be painting these amazing mats. For today's masterclass, my friend, I want you to prepare a piece of paper. It can be A4, it can be A5, it's up to you. I have A5. Also gouache paint. I already put some paint on my palette. So we will need dark yellow, orange, red, light yellow, limey green, black, also some glitter. I will mix it with black. I will add straight away over here. If you have different glitter color, you can use it as well. And prepare the gouache paint, all that you have, just in case. Also, I prepared a template for you, my friend. We're going to be cutting out the bats and tracing them on here. Also, water, brushes, sponges, clean sponges, scissors, tissue paper, and of course, brushes, and prepare baby wipes as well. We will need them because we're gonna have dirty hands. We have to clean them straight away. Cover the table, put something on, and that's it. So now, what we're going to do, First of all, let's prepare our colors. So we have orange, leave orange like that. And I want to take some red and mix with orange. And maybe I will add a little bit of black, slightly bit. So it will be this kind of color. We don't need that it a lot, just a little also prepare a separate piece of paper it can be clean sheet of paper a4 or any any kind of paper that you don't use so we can dab our paint from here and just leave the excess paint either on the palette if you want or we can leave it over there so first of all i'm gonna take my dark yellow darker yellow we need to make it a little bit Add a little bit of water over here and we need to make it desired consistency because we will not wet our sponges so let's take yellow first dab it excess we can put here and in the middle over here like this now we can take straight away with this one orange but make sure that you dab the excess so we have this kind of nice texture on our paper like that so it like this And you do it slightly, you do not press it a lot on the paper because otherwise you will lose this nice texture that we can get from the sponge. Like that. Need to make sure that we don't have any white left over here. So this white is left we will work on it later as well now we can take this darker one we can take it all dab it like this and we can dab it over here Now we'll just take the mixture of like this. A little 
put it together. I will change the sponge into the cleaner one and I will add orange and yellow over here. I'll take another clean one and I will use light yellow and I will dab it over here where this, the yellow sun is. With darker one, the sponge with a dark color, we have to darken it over here. So I'm using the sponge with a dark color, the one that I had, and I just want to make sure that I don't have any white things on here. On the paper like so now we are done with our sponges clean your hands my friend with the baby wipes or the water everything is done and now we need to get back to our bats and let's cut out our bats So I will have three bats, so let's put one bat over here. I'm going to take my thin brush, wet it and mix my black with my glitter. If you don't want to use glitter, that's fine. I just want to use glitter and what we're going to do we're going to trace like that so hold your bat and half of the brush is on the template and another half is on the paper like so And then we're going to color our bat. Now you see, and I have to hold it because it's stuck a little bit, but it's all right. half of the brush on the template and another half 
on that painting. Now, let's remove like so. We just can fix it. But first we need to trace all the bats. Another one is here. Now we can cover the bats. So I will take bigger brush. But if they're dry, we can paint their eyes. Do you see? They have round eyes. For that, I will not use white color. I will use this kind of limey green. And I will have cotton buds. If you don't want to use cotton buds, you can use the tip of your brush. Just see which brush do you need, either bigger one or, or smaller, depending on the size of the bat. So I'm going to... Take this cotton bud and one eye, second one. In the middle, I will put the black. So now here, like that. With the cotton buds, it depends, my friend. You can make the size as well. So for example, if it's bigger with the full strength, if it's a little bit smaller, you do it slightly. And if it's small, then even lighter touches. Everything depends on a touch. And now for my little one, so the touch will be smaller, lighter. So one and two, like so. Now I have to wait until the eyes will completely dry and I will put black inside. It is better, my friend, to uh, leave the eyes to dry, but I will take a very, very thin brush and with the tip of the brush, I will put black dots inside like that. Very carefully, like that. Now, my friend, I want to add a little bit of glitter on my bats you can, because I cannot see the glitter. If it's wet, that's absolutely great, even better. But I will add it it's slightly. You can add different color glitter so you can see it more. I'm adding this dark purple over here. So my friend, this is the end of the masterclass. If you enjoyed it, I'm really very happy. Share your creation with me. I would love to see your bats. And thank you for spending time with me today. Have a wonderful day and I will see you next time.